you guys what your first challenge is today, all right? You guys have probably seen uh, that there's some items laid out here in the middle of the floor. Uh, those are some survival items. Uh, and so, so you, here in just a minute, you guys are going to get the chance to uh, capture as many survival items as you can. Uh, and, and the things that you think you're going to need for today. All right, on your mark, get set, go! go. go, go, go. Satisfied with what they got? No! With the items that you guys have collected, you have to make a contraption that will allow this baby to float on it out in the stock tank that's outside. So you have to create something uh, that will allow this baby, will cause this baby to float in the stock tank outside all of baby motors. This, how is this little event kind of like life? Is there, is there any similarities between what you just did and what life is like? Yeah, there's takers. <laughs> there are takers, yeah, there are takers in life. Uh -huh. And then there are people who are gentle with other people who hurt them. That's right. And I think you were that way. You weren't, you, you weren't such a taker that you're willing to hurt people. Oh, no. Oh, 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 they're going to try to oh, yeah. that ain't that's no, never going to work. work. No, that will never work. They don't have, yeah, a, they don't have a poncho. Yeah, uh. They're trying yeah. to use a head net instead of a poncho. <laughs> that will never work. <laughs> hey, you guys want to trade real quick? What do you want to trade? We'll take, we'll take the jump rope to the poncho. No. Okay, okay. But I will trade you one box of matches for the poncho. You'll go half a poncho for a box of matches. Let me see how solid size is the poncho. I don't, I don't know if we really need the poncho. You don't know. You might have to get in there later. No, I don't think we need the poncho. Oh. I think we're going to regret this. We might regret it. I don't know. Let me see. Yeah. You want half? And you guys got three boxes of matches? But that's not going to help him float. Oh, that sounds like a trade to me. That's not going to help him float. I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll cut good. this in half, and then we'll, we'll take that box of matches. What do you think? You know what we got? Uh, it's not going to help him float no, any. Okay. Put, put him in there. Oh, that'll, ooh, look here. Got it. You got it. Yeah! Let's get, oh, yeah. let's get on this. Let's see. Oh, oh. Whoops. Oh. Oh. <laughs> so were there any frustrations in the challenge? Just that team. Oh, that team? Yeah. Here, let's get, let's get that, team that team. Right Which there. ones are they talking about? The turkeys. Okay. <laughs> uh, so was the challenge what you expected when you were getting your supplies? No. Oh, I would have picked something else to float that would float. Good. We so, were prepared for so, so how is that? How is that like life? Do you have any experiences of life like that where you expect one thing and it turns out to be another? Yeah, all I can think of is state for cross country. Like I was expecting to get all state, but then just came out. We missed it by 14 spots. It was really bad. But I was ranked like 18. I was expecting it, but it just didn't happen. So. So how do you? So Murphy, how do you deal with that when you when life deals you something that is unexpected, is not what you wanted? You just keep training. Pray a lot, get over it, and then get ready for next year.